particularly compared to my hair. Her sister's I knew that ponytail was not really good. I was going to take it to my class. I was happy. I was very successful and happy. It's like everything is zero City College art major Hannah De La Rosa held her first art exhibit on April 10th during the second Saturday Art Walk in Midtown Sacramento. I am an up-and-coming artist and I decided to call this one Eyes of Han because I mean, no one's ever seen my work again. I mean before so I, you know, the eyes would be everything I've drawn, painted, you know, little sections of myself. And De La Rosa's art can be described as surreal expressionism. She chooses color palettes that reflect her emotions from within, and she creates art that stimulates the human eye. De La Rosa explained what medium she uses to create her artwork. Oil because it stays wet longer, and I, I'm always kind of reshaping my idea of what I want it to be, and I'm really trying to find it inside of the canvas, and if I don't, and if I write too fast, I'm angry. So oil is probably my best bet, but I do like messing with the curls. It's just it drives faster. De La Rosa has been drawing since she was two years old, and she is inspired by Frida Kahlo and Salvador Dali. She has many inspirations that motivate her artistic endeavors. My mother, Sacramento, California, America, the world, um, everything, the ground, the walls, just everything turns itself into something else. Many artists create their own timelines to complete a piece. De La Rosa explained. To show people what I see when I try to, you know, stay in painting, usually it takes me more than a couple days and a couple hours. It takes me a while to finish a painting. I'm, I'm constantly going back and fixing it. It's called Halo. Um, this, is, this is how I feel about them. Love my life at the time, whoever they, that may be. Um, it's just, I feel like. I'm paper and the universe is growing inside of me, you know, the butterflies. It's called monochromatic alcoholic, and this is actually a friend of mine, hunched over a desk, passed out because he had a really bad hangover. I just made a quick sketch, I turned it into a painting, but I was doing, I was actually studying monochromatic in my class, so I decided to use that and do it as well. And it kind of worked out perfectly because I was able to play with the color and different, you know, transitions of it and turn it into, you know, just something cool. It's empowering and nerve-wracking at the same time. I really don't know how to feel. I don't know if I should be scared, if I should be excited and try to, you know, put my foot down, this is me, or if I should just reform myself like clay. I just, I'm crazy right now. <laughs> De La Rosa will have another art exhibit during the second Saturday Art Walk on June 12th at Bang Gallery on 21st at L Street in Midtown Sacramento. If you would like to view some of De La Rosa's artwork, Check it out at the Second Saturday Art Walk website at 2ndsaturdayartwalk.com backslash artists.